So I did Thor, and of course it's by me. Yeah. Next slide. Ooh. So who was he? Thor was the Norse god of thunder. He was the son of Odin and Frigga. He was he's from Asgard and has many supernatural abilities, as well as a magic hammer called the Thad. And in the Marvel Comics universe, he is one of the Avengers. I forgot to add. Him. So what was his significance? Thor was a very significant figure in his time period and even now. We, as in Marvel, were able to take a Norse god and turn him into a fictional character using some of the same information from the Norse history. Thor has protected his home, Asgard, from his common enemies, the giants. He has also overcome one of the greatest things everyone and anyone, no, everyone is and can be challenged with, overcoming his arrogance and not letting it take over his personality. Next slide. Um, so, Thor's magic hammer was giving, given to him by his father after he proved to him that he was worthy enough to put, have possession of it. With, his, with this hammer, he was able to summon lightning strikes and in the MCU, the hammer also gives Thor flight assistance. He also has a belt of strength which doubles his strength every time it is used. In MCU, the hammer was was made of Uru, and only one who is truly worthy, Thor and a few others, are able to pick it up. And then the next slide. So that's the Norse, what the Norse hammer would have looked like, and then that's the MCU hammer. So I just thought, like, how similar yet different they are. I thought that was cool. Next slide. So fun facts about Thor. Thor's Day, Thursday, is named after him. He's an Avenger, but only in the MCU, and he's my favorite Avenger. And yeah.